How's it going everybody? This is Golden Bolt and welcome back for more Pokemon Sun. In the last episode, we were adventuring through Vast Pony Canyon and I said I was gonna fight this trainer, but I accidentally off-screened her. I was standing right here, I moved up a little bit and then she turned and looked at me, so that was fun. But anyway, we're gonna go across this bridge here, uh, and hello there. How are you? You look drugged. That's fine. No judgment, no judgments here. Yep, that's my face. You can see it with your eyeballs. Oh, now that's a great composition. I could paint a picture of you. The visitor to Pony. I guess I didn't introduce myself though. I'm Mina, I'm the captain. I mean, I sort of am. I actually just wander around doing my art, so I don't have an actual trial or anything, but Vast Pony Canyon sure is a wonder, huh? We already fought the Kahuna. What are you talking about? You're a captain, but once you really get through this place, you can really get to understand why that Illuma boy redesigned his trial the way he did, right? Oh yeah, oh yeah, here, take this as a token of our acquaintance. And yeah, she gives us Fairy MZ, which is kind of a big deal for just being like, Hey, let's talk, how are you doing? It's a Fairy MZ, get your Z on. Uh, I'd love to have a Fairy type, but I don't, Mina, or even a Fairy move. I'm the captain and all, so I've got to come up with a trial. Maybe it would involve painting pictures and picking flowers. Maybe a trial like that could be cool? Hey, I like painting pictures, and flowers smell nice, so that's something, I guess. I don't know what the heck that girl's talking about. Let's get out of here, guys. I don't know what she's talking about. Anyway, uh, we are almost through Vast Pony Canyon, everybody. It's not too much longer here. But yeah, Ilima, that's a name we haven't heard of in a long time. We have not heard that name in, like, episodes and episodes. Ilima was, uh, if you remember, the first ever captain, and they made a huge deal of him being, like, a captain. But he was, I guess, a big deal being the very, very first one, so I guess that's something. Uh, yes, I'm gonna use another one, even though I'm just kinda going down here to see what we got down here. Uh, what is the point? What is the purpose of this? I don't actually know what's around here, so let's find out. Apparently, just an item. Full heal. Was it worth it? Yeah, I guess so. Full heals are alright. But man, guys, I am so, like, sore today. I've incorporated, like, a workout routine where I am actually working out every single day in the very limited free time I have. My free time is essentially going to this and working out. So that's fun, though, because I normally, I don't, I, I don't have a, I've never had, like, a very, uh, like, stringent, if that's the right word, workout routine or anything like that. I've never been committed to it, but now I am, and it's awesome, and I feel great, except I'm really freaking sore all the time, so that's fun. Um, I'm not, like, an out-of-shape dude or anything. I just, uh, you know, I slack now and then, so it's good to get back on the, back on the grind, you know? It's a lot of fun. Did he have an absol? Because that's reminding me of Alfredo. Absol, ugh, that's still one of my favorite moments in Golden Bolt LP history, is when Alfredo died, uh, in Pokemon Red Rescue Team. If you don't know what I'm look talking about, check out the, uh, greatest moments, dang it, check out the greatest <laughs> moments, uh, for Pokemon Red Rescue Team. And I actually need to get started on the Super Mystery Dungeon one, I've never, I, I forgot that that was a thing I did, so hopefully I'm gonna get started on that, uh, very, very soon, and hopefully maybe this weekend or something like that. It's been a while, but, uh, yeah, I, I definitely want to go through there and... Uh, I had to use me first. Almost killed me. Thank you, Whitaker, for not dying. You're becoming the Deku in this situation. Hey, I can't help it, baby. I'm not even fully evolved yet, and I'm level 45, and I still haven't evolved. Who wants to learn Dynamic Punch? Ooh, it's Dynamic Punch. That's a pretty good move. Uh, confuse the target if it hits. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop Power Up Punch for that. Man, Whitaker really gets those moves that confuse the targets when they hit, like Dizzy Punch, Dynamic Punch, he's all about that stuff. Alright, we're gonna swap out though because Lapras about to mess us up. Let's go ahead and send Melee out, so that's awesome. Oh man, I'm just like, we played, me and my friends, we have about uh, two hours-ish in between classes on Tuesdays. And so when that happens, we um, go on Tuesdays we go to the gym and we play basketball. And, uh, uh, what am I, what am I predicting here? I'm, well, they probably, you probably are going for Ice Move, aren't you? Because I was elect, okay. Never mind, you're not. Um, well, we have about an hour or so to go to the gym. And, uh, we play basketball then. And today, uh, it's me and two, sometimes three friends, sometimes two. Uh, we played three on three against these, oh no, I'm gonna die. We played three on three against these kids who, like, challenged us and they were like, and I say kids because I'm a grad student and they were probably undergrad students, so they're kids, all right? Um, but yeah, so we played against them, and they came over like, you guys want to play? And they seemed like, they played really well, like, I don't, I'm, I'm six foot six, but I never played basketball, like, at school or anything. So, I'm, I'm not, like, the best basketball player. People just, like, assume I am, and it's like, nope, never played on a team or anything, only played soccer. Um, but we played against them, uh, today, 
and uh, we beat them, which is really funny. We beat them. It was really close, though. We did um, just like first to ten points. We just did like ten ones, and we uh, and we beat them. And I got the winning shot. It was a it was a, a three point. Well, I guess it was a two point in that in that situation because we were uh, dumbing it down. Well, just reducing them the amount of points just so they were easier to keep track of. Um, but I ended up doing this huge outside shot, like, from real, real far out. And I was just like, I'm just going to take this shot and see what happens. And lo and behold, it made it. And I was like, huh? Oh, wow, I had hyper potions this whole time. I had hyper potions this whole time, you guys didn't tell me. Just kidding, it's all right. I don't blame you, I blame me. We've got all these guys blocking away. The way you get just, uh, I want to see it all. That's cool. I don't want to show you anything, lady. No matter who you is. I don't know who you is, veteran Heather. It's a great name. I always liked the name Heather. I've met, I think there's only two people I can think of that I've met in my entire life named Heather. Three people. I think my dad has a cousin named Heather. I think, that's a huge, th like you guys would know, I'm just like saying it out loud. But I knew a girl in high school um, named Heather and, uh, and I knew a girl in college named Heather. Two different situations, completely irrelevant. Don't know why I'm bringing it up, just because the name Heather pops into my brain, I guess. Uh, oh, I was kind of hoping you would drag Whitaker out, but this is fine too. We'll go ahead and psychic your face in Stoutland. Every time we fight Stoutland, though, I feel a little bad because of the white randomizer. Oh gosh, oh gosh, no! Oh, Melee, you are cutting it close, girl. You are cutting it too close sometimes, girl. Also, what in the world are those things? They're like weird, swirly versions of Raichu's ears. Hey, are you making fun of my ears? Oh my gosh. Yeah, are you making fun of her ear? That's my girl you're talking about. Uh, I thought you guys weren't a thing. Shut up, I wanna be a thing. Well, Beans, you're gonna have to talk to her or something, man. You're gonna have to do something rather than tell me that you wanna be a thing. Did somebody say they wanna be a thing with me? No, nobody said that. <laughs> I didn't, uh, definitely. Beans, what are you doing? Why would you just say, like, completely deny it? What is your- why would you do that? Uh, because I'm shooting fire out of my crotch. I mean, belt. Whatever, I'm confused. I don't know what's going on. Everything throws beans off. You are gonna be the first Pokemon to hit level, uh, level 50, though, so that's kinda cool. That's a little unique, you know? Nobody's really done that before. Yeah, but... I just wanna have a date with Melee. Who wants to have a date with me? Somebody wants to have a date? Um... Uh, yeah, you know, um... There you go, Beans, just, just swoop in. Say it. Yeah, you know, I want to have a date with Melee. Oh my gosh, okay. Wait, 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 I'm... Ah, shoot. Lost my, lost my chance to Whitaker right now. That's okay. Don't mind, I don't, I don't mind. She's just, uh, better than me. Uh, dang it. That's okay. Anyone can go on a date with Melee. I'm the coolest girl there is. No need to freaking have any, uh, no need to be humble there, Melee. Show me everything you got. Who does this guy think he is? Blocking the altar, throwing his Pokeballs like, hey, uh, show me everything you've got. Last time I checked, the, uh, prophecies didn't say anything about veteran Eric or his weird mustache mouth thing, whatever he's got going on. He's just a weird looking dude. Why does he do that? I don't know. I do not know. What a strange, a strange Magoo. Alright, in any case, we've got Granbull to go against now, uh, so I don't really know what the best plan of action would be, because we don't really have any poison types or- Oh, we do have a steel move with melee. I was like, we don't have a lot- we don't have anything really to count- Why are you always using Roar? The girl before- was it the last person we fought that used Roar? Oh, now you in for it, Granbull. Now you super in for it, except- oh, I shouldn't have done that, well. It should still do pretty well, I think. Uh, nice! I was like, shouldn't have done that because Granbull's just a fairy type now, despite it looking like a regular dog! Why did I say that like a... like some kind of... Boston guy, like a regular dog! Alright, anyway, Leaf Blade is gonna do a lot more than Razor Leaf. Even though Razor Leaf hits everybody, double battles are pretty scarce. Leaf Blade is kind of the cream of the crop in terms of physical grass type moves, and we're gonna display it, because why the heck not? That was a combination of me almost saying why the heck and why the F. I was like, why the heff not? Why the heff? That's gonna be a new, my new catchphrase. Why the heff not? It sounds like I'm swearing, but, uh, but I'm, I'm not. Ah, oh, cool. Alright, yeah, if you haven't noticed, uh, go- 
Why would you? Why, why would you? What's the... Jeez! Live, Deku, even though there's no way you will. Why, why would you do that? Golem is now... has Is rocking electric for reasons. I don't know what the, those reasons are, but... That's what he is. Okay, that's fair. Blowing himself up. Thank you for that, veteran Eric. Glad you did that. Really appreciate it. Alright, and we could have done well against Cloyster, but nope. Guess we gotta use our Rio on it. Okay, he's just gonna prolong it. This guy is just like the suckiest kind of trainer. Spamming, if he spams protect again, then he then it proves it. Okay, well he proves it. It didn't work, but he's proving it. This guy's the worst kind of trainer, because all he does is sit there and, uh... He's, sp he's spamming Protect, and he's using Explosion. Stop, dude! There's no point! Because I'm going to hit you right now. Really? Okay. Why are you just spamming Protect? You're just stalling. You know it's not going to work at some point. Oh, now, of course, like, oh, Roar, baby, it's a nice type move to beat your face in. Come on, Rio. Get him with Beak Blast. That did nothing. Oh my gosh, that thing is tanky as crap. All right. Well, he's going to be using a roar beam on us or a water move. So let's hope, keep our fingers crossed he isn't going for a water move right now. This guy sucks. Why Why do you play like this? A roar beam. Ooh, I'm going to be faster than you though. You dip. That did nothing to me. I'm going to be faster than you because I'm not a clam. All right. Okay, you're faster than me because you're a clam. What? In what world is this clam faster than my wrestling cat tiger panther? That's kind of what he should have been, you know? Incineroar could have been like a really boss looking panther. Like down on all fours, like super dark, like, oh man, like very Bagheera style. But anyway, Beans at level 50, how do you feel about that, Beans? I feel old. That's a good way to put it. I would feel old too. Uh, don't, you no need to lick this thing. Uh, I kind of want to lick it. Okay, go ahead and lick it. I'll let you do it. All right, let's do it. Even though you could have just used Darkest Lariat and done a lot more. I haven't licked a ghost in a while. I need this right now. Did that tongue come out of your... Oh, we paralyzed it. He did the animation. Oh, great. Do you hear that in the background? You, pr you might. Somebody's car alarm is going off. Better not be mine. That's one of my, like, nightmares. No, it's not. It's a, it's a van. That's one of my nightmares is like a car alarm just going off and then I'm just like, oh wow, an alarm's going off. And then I don't, and it just goes on for a while. I'm like, wow, that alarm's been going on for a while and then it ends up being mine. That would be my life. All right, do we want Stone Edge? Yes, well, we want Stone Edge, but what do I want to get rid of? Rock Slide, honestly, yeah, we'll dump Rock Slide for Stone Edge. I know that Stone Edge gets, or Rock Slide gets a lot more PP. And Stone Edge, I think, has less accuracy, but it's super powerful. Really, really strong physical rock move. As all rock moves tend to be, except for Power Gem. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna heal up here, even though I'm pretty sure we're gonna get healed. Not what I wanted to do. Sorry, Melee, you can't be revived. You've already been revived enough. All right, well, we finally made it, guys. The altar is just in front of us. I think we're gonna get revived, and if not, we'll have a moment's reprieve to do that. Wow, that's a throwback. Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. That was a room you could build. Moments reprieve. Ha, ah, ah, ha. Sorry, I'm not very good at running. Phew. It looks like we're nearly to the altar now, aren't we? Let me take care of Lycanroc for you. Called it. Or anyone, or all my Pokemon. Sorry, all of you. Only Hedge gets healed. Doesn't it? Trainer can go anywhere in the world. Does it seem that way? I suppose so, Lily. Is there a trial in Vast Pony Canyon? Or um, isn't this whole place trial enough? You would think so. Very strange. Faint letters can just barely be made out, carved into the ancient stone monument. Ahead lies a sacred ground of trials. None who do not take part in his trials will be allowed to walk upon this earth. <laughs> upon this earth or just the earth? Those lacking the courage to defeat the totem guarding this land will be denied entry. But those who believe in their Pokemon and walk beside them shall gain great power. There's no captain to be found, but it seems like you stand at the edge of a trial site. Are you ready to challenge the trial? I am! We're all healed up! Ah, mysterious trial shows up. What's up with this vast Pony Canyon trial? How did I read these, like, weird hieroglyphs? I read them and I was like, oh yeah, something weird going on. Man, I can read hieroglyphs. Uh, frickin... Uh, Barnaby can read footprints. This is gonna, probably gonna look familiar to those of you who played the demo, by the way. Quite familiar, in fact. Ah, some Jangmo! Yes! Jangmo is the lamest! No, I'm just kidding, he's not really. 
I'm honestly though, I'm gonna probably upset a lot of people by saying this, but I'm severely disappointed by Jang Mo, and that's because he is this generation's pseudo legendary, but he evolves into a dragon and fighting type, which means oh we can't catch him, which means because it's trial site, which means if you're a fairy type. This thing gets shrecked, and it sucks because fairy types are abundant and powerful, and they're not. There's not like a bad fairy type, especially Primarina, who's pretty popular in the meta game. If I if I do believe you, a fiercer gaze than before. But yeah, coming down here, we'll get you Dragon Claw. Um, we'll see if anybody can actually learn that because I've been talking about needing a dragon type move. I don't think anybody can, honestly. But uh, we'll see. Nope, nobody can. I was like, no one really has claws like that or happens to be shaped like a dragon. We don't got Feraligator around here this time, guys. So, oh yeah, more gazes staring at us. Well, it looked a little bigger this time around. And yes, time for the evolution. He does look really cool, Hakamo. -oh. And I am saying that right, apparently. A lot of people verified me when I was playing the demo that it is Hakamo. -oh. So that's fun. Um, but yeah, I just, I wish... So many things about this line of, of this evolutionary this is gonna suck. This thing's a powerhouse though, so don't let you don't let me uh, convince you that it's not extremely powerful. This Pokemon is very very good, and a lot of people really like it. And um, I love its design. Personally, I think it's aesthetically really good, but um, uh, it's just like it's one of those really frustrating kinds of Pokemon, you know? It's like Flareon. It's, it's kind of like that, but more viable than Flareon. Uh, I don't know. You feel the fiercest pair of eyes imaginable drilling you into you relentlessly. I don't appreciate that. I don't like getting... Never mind. I'm not going to finish this sentence. Uh, could have could have sounded awful. But anyway, we are almost through here to the trial. Ah, something sparkles in front of us. Will you take the Z-Crystal from the pedestal? That I will. But it seems like something's going to stop us. That's right, guys. It's time for the last part of the trial against a, our last totem Pokemon, Totem Komo. -o. Jangmo, Akamo, and Komo -o, or Komo. -o. Uh, but yeah, this thing is nuts. This is what I'm saying by like it looks so cool. And when you don't have any fairy types, it's awesome. So if this is something you want to use, go for it, man. It's a great. It's not a bad Pokemon in any. In any sense of the word, it's just really, really frustrating in that it's dragon and fighting. To me. A lot of people would disagree. Um, called in its ally. Yay! That's what I wanted to see. Um, what do you got? Oh, a si What? Okay. That's random. Um, okay. I'm gonna die. This is gonna suck unless for some reason somebody misses. Because they're both gonna... Well, scissors pretty low, but... Come on, Melee, go quick! Uh, this is a pretty cool move, too. I think it, I believe it's exclusive to Komo, Komo -o, so that's pretty cool, but he's lowering his defense like mad. I really need to get in there and do something cool, uh, and that might involve going for Accelerock with Hedge. Might not be the best idea, honestly, but I don't know. We can give it a shot and see what it does. Uh, he's lowered his defense twice by two stages now, so this could do more than expected. I don't think it's going to defeat it, but it's worth a shot. And luckily this thing can't heal itself. Uh, okay, it was not worth a shot. Oh crap, I'm going to die. Goodbye. Oh man. Forget everything I said about Totem, about Como. Oh, this thing is about to mess me up. All right, well, let's go for Rio here and see if we can go ahead and go first with Drill Pack because they seem to be pretty committed. Well, Como seems to be pretty committed to... Uh, to his fighting type moves, so I'm assuming he probably doesn't have a lot to offer in that department. So let's see in the department of screwing Rio over and... Okay, what, did you learn from veteran Ed outside? Or whatever his name was, Eric? And this scissor's just wasting his turn, using Leer on me. Actually, they're, that's kind of good, because they're working as a team. Alright, come on, Rio. I know you're fast. I know you're quick. I know you're a toucan. You can do this. I believe in you. I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. We gotta wait for it to stop lagging. Sky uppercut. This shouldn't do too much, right? Oh, uh, Rio with the save! Come on! That is my bird right there! Taking Como down! Man! That's awesome, and now you gotta die to a scissor. 
Dang it! You did so well, Rio. Oh, that was awesome. All right, let's send Beans out and not even mess with this thing anymore. Beans would have arguably been pretty good in this fight too, but why not give the other Pokemon a chance to shine? Flamethrower it, out your belt, do it. You're level 50, you'll take this thing out one shot. Quad weak to fire is not a good thing, not a good color on you, Scizor, even though you are really cool looking. Such a cool looking Pokemon. Nice job, Beans. Beating the last uh, totem Pokemon we go against. Defeated Totem, totem Como. So yeah, if you're really into that Pokemon, and you're really into that typing, uh, and you're willing to take the risk against those fairy types, definitely get it. It's a good Pokemon. But anyway, we get something really cool after beating that guy. Something really awesome, especially if you got dragon types, or if you have your own Como. -o. Trial complete. Yes, it's Dragonium Z, which which is about as cool as it sounds. I do have to say that. Pretty freaking sweet. Dragonium Z is yours. You cleared another trial, but the real trial will still be pushing beyond this point, I think. I agree with you, Rotom. I agree. We'll be getting to the altar in the next episode, guys. It's right in front of us. Thank you guys very much for joining me on this installment of our adventure. From me to you, have a very nice day, and I will see you guys next time.